Hi, welcome to a SolidWorks 2021 video tutorial. I want to do that planetary gear assembly now in SolidWorks. So you can do it in a similar way as I did it in Inventor. Just make extrude surfaces and then you can make those gear mates between those extrude surfaces and so it works will calculate the correct ratio or you could just type in the ratio anyway let's have fun with solidworks okay let's start by bringing in the ring gear so let's go for step and i want the ring gear open it and just put it there and it will be fixed because it's the first component of this assembly now let's bring in another component and that would be the carrier zero one this one and open it put it right there now let's align this surface with that surface coincident and this axis and that axis should be concentric let's test it yeah it moves great now in order to bring in the planet gear i will open the planet gear in a second window open let's go for a step that would be the planet gear nope let's tile our windows and then i can just drag and drop that planet gear into my assembly over here drag it over there so let's save it and call this one yt planetary gears Okay, bring in another one and a third one. Now minimize that and maximize this one. Now let's add the constraints or mates. So go for, okay, maybe hide that ring here. Now this surface and that surface should be coincident. This surface and that surface should be coincident. And of course this surface and that surface here should be coincident as well. Now let's add the concentric mates. So this one and that one should be concentric. Maybe this one and that one should be concentric. And then the surface and that surface should be concentric as well. Now I can add the mates, the advanced mates or the mechanical mates, but just bring in this one and now go for mate, go for mechanical mates, go for gear and it should be between, you could use that surface as reference and maybe this one. That will give you just an idea because that's not the correct ratio. I would have to construct to create here a surface and there a surface but i could just type in the ratio from should be two to one that should do confirm then another one again a gear from this one to that surface two to 
one and another one again a gear made from this surface to that surface here and again two two one and confirm cancel this out and let's see if it works if we rotate this carrier those planet gears should rotate in that direction that's okay great so maybe hide that ring gear again and bring in the second carrier go for step and it, that would be carrier 0 0.2 and now this surface here and that one should be aligned and this axis and that axis should be concentric now let's add another gear constraint or mate go for mechanical gear and that would be of course from one of these surfaces to that axis I will just use this surface as axis and that should be not 10 to 30 but 2 to 1 and confirm so if you rotate this that should rotate in that direction that's okay great and cancel this out now let's tile our window again and bring in some more of those planet gears obviously maybe just maybe where is it oh there you go now let's bring in okay kind of awkward now it's okay bring in three more of those gears one two and three and then i can close this one and maximize that one now this surface and that surface coincident this surface and let's see this one coincident and let's bring it over here this surface and that surface again coincident now let's go for the axis so maybe this one and that surface here concentric and this one and that one concentric and this one and that one again concentric now let's add some gear mates let's bring in this one and go for mate go for mechanical go for oh that's by accident okay go for gear and again it should be this surface and that one and the ratio should be again two to one confirm another one from this surface to that surface here again two to one and the last one from another gear from this one to that surface and again 
two to one. Let's check if this works. So if we rotate this in that direction, those gears should turn in this direction. That's okay. Great. Now finally we can bring in the sun gear. Insert components. We can go for step. The sun gear, open it, put it right there. And now this surface here and that surface should be coincident. And then this axis and that axis should be concentric. Nice. Now let's add another gear mate, which is from this surface to that surface. And again, I want to go for two to one. Confirm. Let's check it out if we ro rotate this in this direction. Yeah, seems to be okay. If we rotate this one here, maybe hide that ring gear. So it's better visible. Yeah, looks great. And I'm done. So I hope it was helpful. Hope you liked it. If you did like it, please give it a like or leave a comment. If you want to see more, please give it a like or leave a comment. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe to my Facebook cafe page. It would be very nice of you. I want to get more likes and subscriptions over there as well. Thanks for watching. See you to the next one. Bye-bye.